Hello, morons. What's up? It's me. I'm back. Uh, basically, I needed freaking something put to post today. And, uh, yeah. So, this is gonna be all be done in one take because I'm too lazy to edit any of this together. Um, I also don't really have much time to edit any of this back together. So, yeah. Um, as I said, one take. Just gonna give some, give some updates on things that are currently happening in my life and things that are going to be happening within the next uh the next little bit and how those things will affect the production and speed of anomaly uh so first things first jumping right into this ah. um first big thing that's coming up is i am actually getting married uh in august and I, i'm very lucky she's awesome it's great um if you guys are following me on Instagram, I'm sure you've seen multiple posts of her. But yeah, I am marrying my fiance in August, and uh, that is going to take me away from Anomaly and the production thereof for about two weeks. Because there's the week leading up to the wedding where I'm going to just be running around doing a bunch of prep work and stuff like that. And then there's the week afterwards where we're doing our honeymoon, we're doing the reception, we're moving into our apartment, and there's just a lot of stuff that's going to be going on. So starting about mid-August when the wedding, in the week leading up to the wedding, production is going to slow down very, very much. Um, and... It's only going to be a two-week span that it slows down, but if you know anything about animation or storyboarding, you know that every day counts, and two weeks is a large chunk of time. Um, the pace I'm currently going right now, I started end of March, early April, and it is now, it is now like mid-June at the time I'm recording this. So it's been about two and a half months, and I'm officially a little over halfway done um, with the storyboards for the, for the pilot episode. So that's really good news, but, you know, two and a half months getting, only being a little over halfway done in two and a half months, that's, that's, uh... I'm not going to say it's slow, because I'm working as hard as I can, as much as I can, and it's honestly a good pace. It's just, it's not the best pace for animation as a whole. For someone like me who's doing all of this animation by himself, it's it, it's good. It's, it's a good pace to go at. But if I was a whole team, that's doo-doo. And so it's just, uh, yeah. Basically, the, that two-week time chunk, the way I'm viewing it, the way I choose to view it, is that's like an eighth of the total amount of time I've spent working on this storyboard. And so that just furthers the amount of time before its completion, or the estimated amount of time before the storyboard's completion, by about another eighth. And so that really isn't the most ideal thing. But I'm not going to complain at all because I'm getting married and I, I think it's a good trade-off. Sorry if you guys sorry if you guys don't think it's a good trade-off, but uh you're not the one marrying a hot redhead, so gargle my kneecaps. The second thing that is coming up on this list of events is in September of this year I will actually be attending Fanex at Salt Lake. And I will be handing out stickers and promoting Anomaly while I'm there. So if any of you happen to be going to FanX, feel free to come and find me if you see the random dude dressed in dressed in a blue jumpsuit, uh, walking around handing out stickers, then uh, feel free to come up to me and ask for one and you can get a you'll get a free sticker. Um, the catch is, I have to see that the, like, before I give a sticker away, I have to see that you're following me. So if you follow, like, so if you just pull up your phone and show that you're following me on Instagram, I will gladly hand you over a sticker and uh, a little info card about who I am, if you want one. And you'll be getting one anyways, honestly, they're stapled to the stickers, so even if you didn't want one, uh, fight me. But, yeah, so there's there's that, and I'm, I'm, pretty, I'm pretty excited. I think that... 
I think that this is going to be a chance to gain a lot of gain a lot of followers for um, for my page and for Anomaly because I'll see I'll be meeting hundreds upon hundreds of people there. You know, we just think of how many people attend these conventions. There's thousands. So let's say I hand out every single sticker that I've ordered. That's about 600 stickers. That's about 600 people. And just doing a, just doing a hypothetical, what if everyone who gets a sticker followed me? That would mean that I get 500 followers, which in the grand scheme isn't that much compared to how much I need for Anomaly to be successful. But compared to, but like a, that many followers in the span of one weekend spent in Utah promoting, that is, that's really good. That's awesome. That's, that's great. Um, and assuming that those people who, you know, follow me go and tell their friends and then those friends tell their friends and then so on and so forth, it'll slowly start growing. My goal is to have a branch of people, just have this, have this whole system of people branching out who want to know more about Anomaly and who want to, who want to see it come to fruition, who are excited about this hypothetical show that they haven't seen yet and, well, that hasn't even been made yet, and they want it to be made because they're in interested in it. That's pro that's honestly the hardest part about creating TV shows and animation and pilot episodes is getting people excited for things that do not exist yet. And so that's where I really need all of your guys' help. Um, just sharing it with everyone that you know and leaving likes on my videos, leaving likes on my posts. Honestly, like the leaving likes part, following me on Instagram, leaving likes on my posts and on my YouTube videos, subscribing, all that. If you think about it, I'm not really asking for much. Uh, all you have to do is press a button and boom, you're subscribed. Press a button, boom, you liked one of my videos or posts. Press a button, boom, you're following me on Instagram. It's Don't do it because I told you to. Do it because it's a button and it's freaking fun to push. But yeah. So the last little significant thing that's going to be happening here in the next little bit that will impact Anomaly directly is I get out of school for the summer. Um, I get out of school for the summer here in a few weeks. I'm currently attending college and having to balance work and Anomaly and school, it's not always the most ideal thing. Um, in fact, it never is the most ideal thing. Ideally, I would be paid to, people would be paying me to you know make anomaly but that's not happening yet so it's 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 whatever it's fine and so i don't really have much time to spend on anomaly as much as i would like to be able to spend more time on it the good news is that with me getting out of school that means that there will be a few weeks during the summer where between me getting out of school and me getting married where i will have a ton more free time because i'm not having to devote you know, hours of my life and hours of my days to schoolwork. I can just devote all of it to normal work and anomaly, which will be quite freeing and really good because that means that progress is going to completely jumpstart. It's going to go way faster because I'll be able to work pretty much full time on this over the summer. Um, unfortunately, once school starts up again, once the summer's over, I am going to have to go back to the schedule of relatively slow production. But it's those weeks where I'm free that are going to count most and going to be the best. Um, uh, I honestly don't think I have anything else to tell you guys about other than just saying thank you so much again for you know watching my stuff, going and following me, supporting me do subscribing just everything that you guys do i i really appreciate it even though like i have i have a very very small corner of the internet i have no significant following or anything like that every little bit helps and you guys are great driving factors behind that so thank you so much for all that you've done um as always uh, make sure to leave a like subscribe go follow me on instagram like a few of my posts if you could that'd be pretty baller of you 
Um, go support me on Patreon if you'd like to. Uh, there's no obligation, you know, no pressure. I can, whether or not I have supporters on my Patreon funding me directly, I will still be able to get this done. But getting funding on my Patreon would just help me to hire outside help so that production would go faster. And that's partly why I'm starting a Kickstarter soon. But in the meantime, this is just going to have to do. So thanks again, and hope you all step on a Lego. Frick off.